Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, this is Battle Media Concepts. Thank you so much for engaging. Please, if you're just joining, if you're just coming to this page the first time, please do well to subscribe. Hit the subscribe button for me there. Alright, thank you. Today we are going to go to CapCut. This is CapCut. And I'm going to do this particular video for beginners, people that are just Opening CapCut, maybe you have CapCut or you don't have it already in your phone or in your PC and you are looking for a way to download it. You are looking for a software that it is that is perfect, appropriate for your video or your video editing. This is the perfect software for your video editing. And I'm going to lead you directly. I'm going to lead you down the line so that you know the particular keys for each particular row. All right, once you finish downloading your CapCut, if you're using your Windows 10, you go to your Microsoft Store and uh, download it, download your CapCut. Or if you are using any one, if you're using your phone, you can go to Play Store. If you're using iPhone, you can go to your iCloud app or whatever and then download it. Once you're done downloading, you open it. This is the interface. This is the board. This is the dashboard. This is what it looks like. So. Once you finish, what you're going to do, I'm going to tell you the buttons one after the other on how to edit. Firstly, this is the import button whenever you want to import anything at all that you want to use and edit. This is the particular key that you will use to import. Then this is the audio where you import any audio sound either from your system, from your library directly or from the um, from the ones generated by the CapCut management. Anyone you want to use. Now let me show you, for instance, uh, no, this is already here, well, I will remove it. Let me import. Okay, I want to import a video. So I'm going to go to my videos and import this for, okay? So when you import it into this place, when you import it into this place, what you first do, as you can see, you see this cross arrow here. Then what you do is to click on the arrow or you can also drag anyone you want to do or you can click here and it will be here. It will come to your panel for editing. This is the line for editing. This particular one here is for cover video, but we are coming to that. So you play your video. As you can see, the video is playing. This is it. This is the video that I just imported. Okay. So once you are done, and you, let's say you want to manipulate this video, like you want to edit it, let's say you want to duplicate it, what you want, what you will do is you click on the video, copy, come to the side and uh, paste. Then this one is the overlay in PC. If you're using laptop, this is your overlay. Why this is the main video, okay? This especially when you want to remove your video background okay so if you want to import sound under this video if you want to import sound this is how to do it okay i'm going to go to audio music okay and like i told you here is where you import everything you want to import why this is for sounds generated by the cap course. so i'm going to import sound this is it here this is the sound i want to use Okay, it's just the same way, the same process. You import the sound. The sound, look at the sound here. So I'm going to play so that you can hear me. You can hear the sound, sorry. Okay. Uh, I believe you, have, you can hear the sound. Okay, so what's the next thing? You can always drag the video depending on the length you want. You can always drag the video. Then the sound, if it is too much, then you drag this for it to be here. You tap Control B, Control B, and it will split it. 
you control Z to take it back, control Z again to take it to undo. Or if you don't want to use control V, you tap the video and you tap here. This is split. Okay, you split it. All right, this one is for to delete. Let's say I, I divided this control B. This one is to delete. Okay, this one is to delete. You can just delete. Okay, so I'm, I'm not deleting that for now. Okay, let's proceed. So this particular one is this. I've showed you how to import the video. I've showed you how to do what, bring in your music. Remember when you're importing any music, if you're using it for any social media or any, then make sure that it is not a copyrighted song so that it will not disturb your video that you are importing. So here, this is the basic. This is where you can edit sound. If it is too loud, you edit it here and you fade in. Okay, then this is where you also fade out. If this fading is for it to slowly come in, you understand, in ascending manner. Okay, then why this is fading out? Okay, descending manner. Okay, then if your song is too loud and you don't like the noise, you can hear this is the place you normalize. This is the place you normalize the sound of your, the, 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 the sound, yeah. The sound of your of the song that you imported or whatever okay then this is the voice let's say you don't want to okay you don't want to be the one talking in the video you want to change it to somebody else this is the voice character you can change it to this ones here and then another person will be speaking on your behalf okay then uh, this is the particular thing so you can use this this anyone here I'm just I just want to be fast so that you understand what I'm going to uh, speech to sound all you need to do is to type in the word that you want okay let me tap here so you type in the word that you want okay this clip actually we're using is too short this is a uh, five seconds I think so it's not even up to one minute so we need uh, something bigger like 60 seconds so that we can apply that particular method okay so animation animation let's say okay let's say control b control b now animation comes you apply animation in between videos as you can see in between videos in between videos here so you place this here and go to animation if you want to try use this, you want to use this, you want to use this, anyone, there are a lot of, there are a lot of animations here. It depends on the one you want to use. Okay, so let's use this for instance. Okay, so, all right, let's see what it looks like. Let's take play from here. Good. You saw that. Very fantastic. Okay. All right. So, that is for animation. You can always choose any one you want here. Then, if you want the color of the video to change, let's say you are shooting a cinematic movie and you want the color of the movie to change. Okay, I'm going to apply the effect on this particular one here, not applying it here, but you also apply here, not here, depending on what you want. So I'm going to choose this. This is for cinematic movie. Okay, then let it download. If it downloads, okay, it's that, that's right. as you can see, the video has changed. So you can see, look at it. The quality just changed, as you can see. Okay, so let's continue with the editing. Then that is for filter. You filter it. If you want it to be like this, like kind of pattern, or what the video you have on your screen. Remember, the video you have on your screen determines the kind of filter you will apply. Okay. The video you, you have on your screen will determine the kind of filter you will apply. Let's see, for instance, something like this. Okay, so this is outdoor video. So you need to apply something that is somewhat in, in synchronization with what you are doing. Okay, this one is for effect. Let's say you want to manipulate the video or you want to, you know, 
had some effects on the video. Let's use this one, for instance. Okay. Okay. Yes. All right. As you can see, so you can sometimes you can just manipulate it like beds. You can put it like bed, or you can also use this. As you can see, playing this. Okay. This is for fading out. So this should be at the ending part because. This is this is for ending of the video. Okay. okay. All right. Here, the end of the video. Here it is. We're going to take it down here. So let's see what it looks like. Okay. So that is the end of your video. If you the effects depending on the effect you want here. So here is for your stickers. Here is for your stickers. Let's say I want to apply this. Okay. Let's say I want to apply this. This one is especially for all these war films, you know, all these war films. So you apply it in a way that it will not affect you. Go to your screen, you know, or let's say if he matches, if he matches, Okay, where would I put it? You put it in a way that you synchronize. Okay, let's see what it looks like. Okay, wait. Let's shift it a little bit. Okay. Okay, let's see if the video, the fire is coming up from his leg. So you can always do yours, you know, based on your own creativity. But well, I'm not editing anything now, so I'm just. You can also make it to be large or uh, for him to disappear. You can just play. Okay, so we don't need this. So I'm going to delete this. Delete this. So this is it. Then here is for text, default text. Okay, so wherever you want to place your text, you place it and you can drag, position it anywhere you want it to be. You position it so this is it all right i'm going to write bmc the name of my company bmc concept all right so i am going to so you can see so i, I don't really like this kind of color it's not really looking uh, awesome so what i'm going to do is that I am going to come to this side as you can see I'm going to come to this side this is the particular if you look this side here is the size you can always manipulate the size uh, put the size the way you want okay then this is for the color this particular part is for the color any one you want you can always this looks nice this looks nice as well this looks nice Okay, so all right, I'm going to add animation to this video. I would like it to come from the inside, so you can always, um, you know, oh, sorry, talking about the test. So you can always, you know, manipulate wherever you want. Bubble, this is also for the test. Let's say you want to, you know, you know how to, you know, let's say. Is I normally use this at the ending part of my videos. You know, you can always scale it and also put animation. You understand? The animation will still be there. Okay? The animation will still be there. This is for animation out, for it to go out. You want it to go out. Ooh. As you can see. Alright? Alright. So that is for test all right so if you don't want to if you don't want to test you can just do this this up and delete okay so what next um <clears throat> if you want to import sound into your music so depending on the kind of song you want if you do want traveling r and b pop you just tap here let's say you want travel you can tap here and uh, let's say beach whatever 
you want you tap beach beach sound and as you can see the sound is going to display here so you can see all the sounds are here right now they have displayed here okay so this is it the sounds have displayed here so you can see so you can choose any sound of your choice here if you don't like the ones here you can always go and what tap here and import from your system okay then um if you want manipulation effects look at them here filter transition effects sticker we we'll use any there are so many stickers here recording subscribing if you're a youtuber uh, mac kind of uh, mac this one is another kind of effect this one is arrow this one is if you want to attach something in your phone this one is also good depending on the, what you are i'll go and put it so you can see you want to see the arrows you can see the stickers tests audio this one is for sounds let's say you're a tiktoker here you sign in your tiktok account sign in your tiktok account so that any video you can easily upload it okay yeah. so adjustments this one is for the video okay this one is for the video quality all right you so, this is adjustment over here as you can see this is the adjustment if you don't want to go there and edit what you want to do you can dab the video this is adjustment as well adjustment is two here okay the reason why for this particular one the reason for this particular one here sorry the reason for this particular all right yeah yeah the reason for this particular one is if you if you if if you go to this one directly and edit from here it will remain only on this particular one understand me okay it will remain only on this particular one but if you use if you use this particular one to edit the quality of your video you can always duplicate you can always duplicate it as you can see duplicate it wherever you place it that is where that quality we also affect okay it will always also affect it all right yeah but so can you make a just okay so it can also affect the quality of the video but if you just go here and uh just like this and you just edit from here the quality will be internal inside the video and it will not affect others this is why this is important for you to use this to edit your video okay now let's talk about the ratio this is um 16 by 9 which is majorly for youtube all right now let's say you want to shoot for instagram or you want to shoot portraits this is 16 by 9 landscape all right this is 9 by 16 portraits okay so you can see it has changed portrait so you can always zoom in your video this is how to zoom this is how to edit a portrait video in CapCut. okay this is how you can always zoom in then if you also do this you can always zoom out back and always zoom out so just press ctrl z all right you just press ctrl z and everything will just go back to the normal size okay so here are the ratios this particular one is for tiktok this for tiktok as well all right depending on what is short so all the video or youtube shots as well this is where you can edit the videos is it for instagram instagram is 1.1 yeah custom editing and you if you want to edit the size maybe you have a size in your mind that you want to edit 
the video into this is where you tap and edit type in the size you want okay so here is if you want to let's say watch the video i'm going to delete edit the quality of the video let's say you don't want to use uh you don't want to use uh Okay, here we are. Sharpen it. I just want to do a little editing now, like I'm not really editing anything for now. Region it. This is for white, this is for black. This is majorly used for remembrance. Okay? For remembrance. So depends on what you want. Okay? Depends on what you really want. Okay? So you can also title it and this one is for curves very important i normally use this to make my video so you can see so you can see can you see it so you can see this is what these are for okay so if you get what you want you can always leave it and it will affect it i use green and white green and white to get what i want majorly what i want okay this is let's say you want it to be dark like in the middle of the night okay this is where to edit it as you can see okay here is what where you can edit it okay so let's say you want to um track you want your text before i'm going i'm not i'm going to delete all this I'm going to delete all this. Let me create uh, another folder. New project. I'm going to create a new project so that we can edit this properly. I want to show you something. All right, we import. Um, go to videos. Things. The video is no longer available. The video is no longer available well as you can see this particular one let me just drag it in you know okay so you allow it to load you allow it to load okay so this is cap cut for you this is cap cut if you want to mirror the video you mirror it and the position will change mirror okay please some part of the video will freeze here you need to scroll a little bit yeah this is going to it's going to freeze you don't move like picture and you move back listen it the freeze i love it so much because in in phone it is more difficult to edit that's why i love editing with pc it's very nice so i think that will be of all for now in another video we can explain more so we also have videos uh we have we have videos that you, sh you would like to watch you please you before you click anything on your cap cuts, please click the subscribe button it is very important